Well, congratulations, Jono. Like a lot of the netballers in the room, but obviously as an umpire, you have had a massive year. Highlights for you for 2015? Um, definitely the highlight of me for this year was umpiring my third ANZ Grand Final. Um, that match in Brisbane was just like something else. The last minute I haven't heard myself <laughs> think yet. And obviously um, starting the year with a test series in Jamaica and ending at World Cup was pretty special. Now you umpire a sport that is predominantly played by women and I'm sure it has its challenges for you at times. Is there any one team or one player for that, for that matter? <laughs> that you find challenging for any particular reason? No, I love all the players. Oh. Great answer, Jono. Carry on. Yeah, it's all good. <laughs> OK, well, moving on, let's talk about the rules. Now, there are a lot of rules in netball. If you could get rid of one rule, what would it be and why? Well, I think the rules that I'd want to get rid of, I've got been rid of, and from 1 January next year, not blowing the whistle for the goal, not blowing the whistle for the ball going out of court, not worrying about setting a penalty. What about centre circle? Oh yeah, that's a pet hate. Pet hate? I pet mean, hate of yours? Absolutely. I mean, there's other things I'd rather be watching than whether yeah. a player's got their big toe in the circle or not. <laughs> now, you've been to Commonwealth Games, you've been to World Champs, World Cups, what else is there on the John O'Brien bucket list for you in terms of your umpiring aspirations? Um, I just want to keep uh, really enjoying my umpiring and continuing to push the boundaries. Um, I'm starting off next year with a test series between England and Australia, which I'm really looking forward to. I haven't done a three test match series between those two teams. And obviously as a New Zealand umpire, that's the pinnacle game that we can do. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. Well, congratulations. And you go and fly the Kiwi flag for us in England. Well done, Jono. Thanks very much. <laughs>